This is how much stuff we have for a two-day trip in the mountains. Two days. Not one week. Not one month. Two days. Those are uh, snacks and those heat up hot pots that you heat up on our own. Then here is the stove and this light. We're going to be using it so that we don't have to eat in the dark. Whoa, whoa, bleach. Okay, bleach. <laughs> I don't know what that's for. Snacks for the hike itself. <laughs> Um, his clothes and all his stuff. I, I, I don't know what's what's in there. And then that's just my basic regular stuff. Yeah. Oh, and here we have our um, containers that we gonna be eating from, I guess. And I, when I saw this, I was like, oh my god. Are we gonna be washing vegetables on the mountain? And I guess we are. And this is full of um, dumplings and beef. I guess the veggies are in here too. I thought that I traveled pretty heavy as a self-proclaimed minimalist, but this is something totally new to me. <laughs> so Beef and I are not serious hikers like some of my friends. We're not serious outdoor people, but we did have a really nice time hiking at last year's New Year's Day. And it's become kind of a tradition that on New Year's Day, we go on a hike. Last time we went on a spontaneous weekend hike, Beef brought these self-heating hot pot rice things. So we had that at the bottom of the mountain once we finished our hike. And although we weren't really prepared, eating in the dark, sitting on the floor, it was still a pretty fun experience, especially compared to going to one of those big restaurants where they serve home style food. It's like this huge plate and it's two people, you can't really finish it. I feel like this trip is gonna be a lot more focused on the food than on the actual hike itself. So we'll see. This is all the stuff we have. <sighs> Plus even table and chairs for sitting outdoors. So we just got here and then I realized that my backpack is broken. <laughs> we just tied it up together like this. I didn't even realize that. I, I, I remembered that it was broken, but I forgot. And yeah. <laughs> this view. So blue. My absolute favorite thing about this trail is that there's nobody else but us, which is a really luxurious feeling in China. Basically, anywhere you go in the wild or some random mountain, there's gonna be people there. It's super peaceful and calm. stuff when they're going traveling or hiking okay look inside there's red bean and like peanut lotus all kinds of things it's really sweet way sweet for me not bad but it's like a dessert I think beans are quite nutritious for when you're doing these kinds of sports.
those are all the people that miss out on the hike. They're taking it the easy way. <laughs> Yeah. <coughs> okay, go. Oh, yeah. Wow. We finally made it to the top. Ah, oh, that was exhausting. It's only three hours. We're at an elevation of about 800 meters right now. And that was only, only like 8K. But yeah, we are exhausted. You know, you get hot, you take off your clothes and you get cold again. And um, I was carrying a really big backpack. Both of us have really heavy backpacks. But wow, at the top, there's no one else here but us. Hey guys, there's a man. Ah, so easy. <laughs> now we're gonna enjoy this lovely view. And this is the veg. Looks like cauliflower. <laughs> cauliflower, lotus root, black fungus, and looks like some bamboo shoots as well. Let's see what we have here. This is the beef. Yep. Lastly, the sauce. Sizzling already. Ooh. Okay, this one is even cooler. Everything goes into this bag and it smells really yummy. There's like this kind of meat sauce in there and rice. Apparently this one is especially for outdoors. And it all comes in a bag. There's even this is gonna be made into a soup. That's so cool. I'm usually not a big fan of trying these types of things because I feel like they have a lot of additives in them. But last time I had one, it wasn't that bad. And when you think about it, basically all foods you eat that are not made by yourself will have all kinds of additives in them. So we're in the outdoors, what can you do? Put in the little auto heating bag, put in the soup, then put in the rice bag. It's crazy. And then the last step is adding in water. Okay. You can see the water in there. <laughs> there is our dinner. It's a little bit scary. I don't want to go too close, but check it out. Wow, looks good. And the rice. Ooh. So cute. You just stick them together. Okay. A little fun. Ready? It's kind of like astronaut food to me.
现一个东西，没有人，<笑>我们包场啦！这种感觉好舒服，因为任何其他地方，你如果在假期想出去玩，是很多人，人山人海，然后就感觉啊、哦，好累啊、哦，就想回家了。我们今天很幸福，就我们两个。